he glitched the one of his own. Now, people, <laughs> let me, Richard let don't got to get the money Robert. in his hand. Go ahead, go ahead. Let me ask you this, Robert. Okay. If, if you, I can't put everything against him because I'm, I'm going to say this. If given the opportunity, which he did, because I had let him know I'm heading out there, right? Obviously, in my opinion, it would have been nice of him to even message me and say, hey, what's your email, bro? Let me message you real quick and say behind the scenes, hey, listen, um, you might not want to come out here. And right. I'm saving you a lot of money and time by telling you this particular information, but I hope that you don't expose it. Um, I run a, a show behind the scenes that allows me to get these numbers. And if you come out here, you're not gonna be able to get those type of numbers. That would have been common courtesy, but you know, like I know, him putting that informa information out there would have probably said, I can't give him that information because that's just gonna blow things out the water. And what happened this last week or so with his testimonial about I cheated would have probably possibly happened back in 4th of July when, when you know, he's taking right. the risk. If I if I give Eric that inside, inf inside scoop, who's to say that he's not gonna say, hey, look at, I have a screenshot. Richard ended up sending me that this, and this is what he's really all about, you know? Right. And so he's not gonna put it out there. He wasn't, you know? But in a perfect world, you know? Right. But, you know, it, it was just basically for me, a learning experience. Um, and, and you know, the funny thing is, I'm not really that type of gullible person. 